हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल स्टडी वन मोर मीन वैल्यू थियरम दैट इज कॉशिस मीन वैल्यू थियरम नो लेट्स सी व्हाट इज द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ दिस थियरम इफ एफ एक्स एंड जी एक्स आर कंटिन्यूस इन क्लोज इंटरवल ए टू बी and differentiable in open interval a to b both these functions are continuous in closed interval a to b and uh, differentiable in open interval a to b then there exist at least One C belongs to A to B, for which f of B minus f of A upon g of B minus g of A. This is uh, equal to f dash C upon g dash C. This is statement of Cauchy's mean value theorem. Now, from this expression, generally students think this is ratio of uh, LMVT or mean value theorem for functions f x and g x. What they do? They divide numerator and denominator by b minus a. So we have uh, f of b minus f of a upon b minus a. This upon g of b minus g of a upon b minus a this is equal to f dash c upon g dash c now the argument students put is that this is a mean value theorem statement uh, for function fx and this is mean value theorem statement for function gx so we are actually dividing these two statements but this is not true always let's see on the graph we consider interval a to b in this interval we draw the graphs of uh, fx and gx so we have this is the graph of fx and suppose this is graph of gx this is y is equal to fx and this is y is equal to gx this is point a comma 0 and this is point b comma 0 we have interval a to b the coordinates of this point are a comma f of a coordinates of this point are b comma f of b for this point coordinates are b comma g of b and for this point coordinates are a comma g of okay now for mean value theorem what we do we join this two points here and we join this two points on the graph of function y is equal to gx now on the graph of y is equal to gx we consider a point where tangent is parallel to ab so we have uh, this point on the graph of y is equal to fx at this point this tangent line is parallel to chord ab this is point c comma 0 and on the graph of function y is equal to fx this point is c comma f of c the slope of tangent at this point is f dash c so we have f of b minus f of a upon b minus a is equal to f dash c now for this point the coordinates are c comma g of c now if i draw tangent line at this point then this may not be parallel to this chord which is visible uh, from the graph 
that means uh, uh, g dash c is actually not equal to g of b minus g of a upon b minus a it may happen sometimes but uh, mostly or in general this is not true the value of c for which f dash c is equal to this may not give uh, this is equal to this that means this is not actually ratio of uh, mean value theorem for two functions then how can we prove this statement let's see the proof we prove this statement using rolle's theorem now for rolle's theorem what should be the function for that what i do i cross multiply and take all the terms on one side so i get g dash c multiply by f of b minus f of a upon g of b minus g of a minus f dash c equal to 0 that means now we have to prove that there exists at least one c belongs to a to b for which this is equal to 0 and now this is derivative of function g x multiply by f of b minus f of a upon g of b minus g of a minus f of x so we consider this function suppose this is function hx now on this function we will be using rolle's theorem but for that it must satisfy the conditions of rolle's theorem it is given that fx and gx are continuous and differentiable so this function is also continuous and differentiable moreover the values of h of a and h of b must be equal the value of h of a this is equal to put here x is equal to a so we have uh, g of a multiply by f of b minus f of a multiply by g of a then we have uh, f of a multiply by g of b plus g of a multiply by f of a this upon g of b minus g of a now here f of a g of a this term gets cancel out uh, so we get h of a is equal to this now if i put here x is equal to b then i get h of b is equal to this expression you can verify by doing on your own you will get h of b is equal to this that means h of a and h of b are equal now we can use rolle's theorem now what is statement of rolle's theorem there exists at least one c belongs to a to b for which h dash c is equal to 0 the derivative of this function at uh, x is equal to c is this so this is equal to 0 and from this we get this ratio is equal to f dash c upon g dash c so here the proof is from Rolle's theorem but what did we do for that? we proper function to choose for which we will use this theorem now let's try some questions based on this theorem 